Welcome back to Post Time. We are up to our final Rickshaw Rumble event, and it's for those star-studded Colts. Defending champ, Roger Bosch. All right. Now, what have you been doing to train for this year's event? I've just been training to beat Tyler Davis. You know what I mean? Because, you know, he's just a punk. So I want to beat him. Mike Cole, he'd be no, no factor whatsoever. Now, I noticed you had a new decoration on your back. Is that in, in honor of this event? Uh, yep, it has my, both my girls' names. If you looked in the horseshoes, it had Chelsea on one side and Sydney on the other. Uh, yeah, it was an idea for that. And also, you know, it's got my last name there. And pretty cool, you know what I mean? Where's your sister this year? Uh, she, she decided to bail out on me this year. But I got a better, improved driver. Excuse me, excuse me. Are you the better driver he was just referring to? Yes. What are you going to do this, uh, this year to help you win? Just win. How many appearances you think you will make this year as Miss Delaware? Oh my goodness, well if there are 365 days this year, at least two a day, so I guess double that throughout the year. It's going to be quite a busy year ahead of me. I promise you that the Rickshaw Rumble will be the most unique appearance that you will make the entire year. I promise you that. And you know what you're in for. And um, tell me, do you know anything about your horse? I know that I am racing with Victor Kirby. I'm so excited and we have the perfect colors because they're Christmas colors, which you can't help be happy about. And um, I know that he's a great uh, driver, so I'm excited to be on the other end and see what he's got as a horseman. That's right. And of course, you guys have like the Marymount magic happening, right? Yes, we do. Victor and I both went to Marymount University in Arlington, Virginia. So I think that luck will bring us together since we've got obviously that bond, the two of us. <laughs> I can't let her go without having her plug her platform because it's all about that in pageantry. So, honey, you plug away. Well, my platform is the National Alopecia Arietta Foundation. I've been supporting them for quite a few years now. I have Alopecia Arietta myself. I've had it for 12 years, so I'm so happy to be their national liaison and be able to spread awareness about what this disorder means, which is just unexplainable hair loss. So I'm so happy to have this chance throughout this whole year and as hopefully Miss America to be able to promote my platform. I'm not going to be able to go to Las Vegas. Don't be upset, okay? I will be cheering you on from home, okay? So when is the Miss America contest? Everyone has to tune in January 15th live on ABC. It's going to be hopefully at 8 p.m. And I'm so excited because hopefully you'll hear Delaware called in the top 15. <laughs> I have like perma smile. I'm so excited about that night. I cannot wait. I will throw a huge party for you in Delaware at my house and we will be cheering you on all the way. Good luck. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so excited to do the race today. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> all right now, Tyler, you've driven in a few of these rumbles, right? Yeah. And this year you got a whole different horse. How does that uh, change things for you? Well, Sean's not very fast, so I um... don't <laughs> I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm gonna do very good this year. <laughs> okay, Justin. Now, you've been away from the Rumble for a little while. Uh, where have you been? Uh, I just been out in the pasture. So, what's your plan for tonight? Uh, I've been uh, pretty much sitting around eating. <laughs> That's about it. Everybody else looks like they're in a lot better shape than me. Just not fall down, really. <laughs> That's what I'm going with right now. All right, Tyler, there's been a lot of trash talking on Facebook. Well, that's, that's fine. I, I do my talking on the track. Team Double T. Now, I know you're feeling really good about your team this year. Oh, yeah, yeah, we, uh, we got a ringer in here. We brought him all the way from Guatemala. <laughs> are, are you from Guatemala? Yeah, but don't tell anybody. Okay, Victor, you are a confirmed retiree. Yes, I am. What am I doing racing? Is it true that the only reason you're back is Miss Delaware? That's the only reason. They drug me out of retirement just for her. For our final Rickshaw Rumble division, it's the Colts. And here's the field. This is always a super competitive race. And once again, I really, really want to thank all the runners, AKA the horses and their drivers and their sponsors for making this race and the whole Rickshaw Rumble night a big success. The horse people of Delmarva are wonderful. Thanks so much.
They're off from the inside. Mike Cole out this year. It's Mike Cole being chased by Tyler Davis. Tyler Davis draws off to beat Mike Cole. Roger Botch in third. The Colts division was won by horse Tyler Davis with a driver, Eric Davis. Yes, it was at Eric Davis double in the Rickshaw Rumble. Their team sponsor was Alan Davis and Eddie Davis Jr. Well, another successful Rickshaw Rumble evening has come to an end. I just want to thank all the participants, the sponsors, drivers, and of course the horses. You know what? Rickshaw Rumble 2011 is going to be here before we know it, so start training now. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you had a great time today. If you would like to know more about Horse Lovers United, an organization that finds homes for racehorses who can no longer compete, give them a call at 410-749-3599 or visit them on the web at horseloversunited.com. During these trying economic times, more and more people are asking for our help, but less and less people are adopting. Maybe you can help foster or find homes or help with fundraising. Call HLU and help a retired Standard Bread star. Before I turn you loose, let me go over the live racing schedule one more time. Now remember, this is the final week of the 2010 fall meet at Harrington. The schedule is Sunday through Thursday, first race post times at 5.30 p.m. Have a wonderful week, see you at the track, and God bless. Now, you're one of the younger drivers out there, but you've seen a lot of the rickshaw rumbles. What's your strategy? I don't know. Stall the horse. I don't know. <laughs> well, how are you going to drive? I don't know. Post time is taped in front of a live studio audience.